So for division of fractions, we're going to do exactly the same thing that we did for division of whole numbers. And again, keep in mind that arithmetic is bookkeeping. So what did we do with whole numbers? Remember that there's two ways of looking at the division A divided by B. We can either view it partitively or quotatively. And in a partitive division, the divisor B is going to be the number of parts and the quotient is going to be the size of each part. On the other hand, if I'm looking at this as a quotative division, the divisor B is going to be the size of each part and the quotient is going to be the number of parts. Both of these interpretations of division are important for finding fractional quotients. So, for example, let's take the first problem, 27 and 3 quarters divided by 3. And again, we'll set up our place value chart because the arithmetic of fractions is not any different from the arithmetic of whole numbers. It is identical to the arithmetic of whole numbers in the idea that the entire goal is to keep track of how many of which units. So here I have 27 numbers, I have 3 fourths, that's what I have here is my fraction and the amount, I'm dividing that by 3, and if I am viewing this as a partitive division, then what I want to do is I want to take what I have and form three equal sets from that. So from this 27, what can I form? Well, I can form three sets of 9, and from this 3, I can form three sets of 1. And my quotient is going to be the size of each of these sets. Each of these 1, 2, 3 sets has 9 and 1 fourth. So the amount is going to be expressed as 9 and a quarter as my quotient. What if I'm doing a division like 4 divided by 2 thirds? Well, here's their problem is that I can't really make good sense of what I might mean by two-thirds parts. So it doesn't make a lot of sense to talk about this as a partitive division. So I can also view this as a quotative division. I'm going to take four and I'm going to break it up into parts of size two-thirds. Now a picture might help, so let's draw four units. Space is cheap, so let's draw those fairly big. So here's my four, and I want to form two-thirds from this set. So, well, if this is one, then to form two-thirds, I'm going to break that one up into three pieces, and I'm going to take two of them. So there is a two-thirds. Well, anything you do once, you can do as many times as necessary. I want to form another two-thirds, so I'll break this one up. And let's see, well, here's a two-thirds right here, and there's another one right there, and I'll keep going. I'll break this up, I'll break this up, and there's, and let's see. So as a quotative division, how many two-thirds can I make from my initial four? I can count one, two, three, four, five, six, and so my quotient is going to be six.